ones at the hospital. They will never notice my distractions. I ain't done yet. Get ready for my strongest attack. Hey! Aw, oh, man. Oh, I survived. When the actual gosh darn tarnation is happening here. You felt your training was lackluster. So we gave Clover a real challenge. I'm disappointed in for you for Eight weeks of lessons for this? I'm gonna lock you away with the feathers. Star, what's going on? You've been different. A real meanie. It's true. This is, hasn't been any fun. What are y'all blabbering about? This is the most alive this town has ever been. Why does everything have to be a spectacle, huh? I miss the old North Star, the fearless leader. Monster who can make their own fun in the little things. This new star is selfish and reckless. Or should I call you by your real name? Did I Starlo? Why you? What's with all the shouting? What's happening? It seems my posse don't respect me no more. It's not that. It just wants you to take it down or not. You can't just throw us around for this human business. That isn't what friends do, Star. I know that all this what all this is about. Y'all are just full of envy, overflowing with it. Over shot circles around you, and you just can't accept it. Oh boy. Over has nothing to do with this. It's you. No, Star's totally right. Over's super skilled at everything. In fact, I think they could carry the whole squad on their own. Who needs us when you got a powerhouse deputy? What are you saying? I'm saying that I'm done. I resigned from the Feisty Five, okay? Really now? It'll still be the Feisty Five without you, so go ahead. Oh boy. I'm leaving too. I don't want to work under a big-headed sheriff. Oh boy. Seems like life dealt you a bad heart hand, Star. I'm following them. Sorry, Star. Please work on yourself. Forgiveness is only one apology away. Fine. I was considering firing y'all anyway. Zeroba, you understand, right? They're being ridiculous. Starlo. They're right. You have changed a lot from the monster I once knew. I tried to brush it off as you having fun at first, but this Wild East thing has damaged your personality. I want to see the real Starlo. That's North Star to you. Oh boy. Well. Well, everyone is gone. I got no posse, no friends. I need to think. I can fix this. Well, shit. Howdy. I was afraid things would escalate. Nothing you're not fully used to by now. This is probably a good time to get out of here. All gone way too far, don't you think? Whatever happens, I wish you luck, Clover. Alright. No, no, no. We're not gonna just let things end like that. Hello. Leave me alone. I've had enough of this town. I swear, no one here really gets me. No, they don't understand the level I'm at. I can't stare at someone and they'll feel true fear. Well, not everyone. Uh... Hello again. Alright. Let's see how we can solve this problem. Okay, so we can't follow them. Actually, Martlet? Any thoughts? I kinda overheard what happened outside. Ugh, I know I shouldn't feel this way, but... Maybe you should go after the Sheriff, Cole. I know he did some mean stuff, but he's out there all alone now. He gained his trust, so maybe you can sort out the situation? And, uh... We still need him to let me out here. Of course. Alright. Let's see what we can do. Therapist Clover is on the... What are you doing here? Hey, kid. Sorry about the whole train thing earlier. Wait, that was you? I love playing the villain, but I never consider how others felt. Maybe in the end, that's what makes me the real villain. Ah. At least he has acknowledged it. Alright. Alright, Starlo. Oh, eight points. Howdy. I was hoping Starlo ran to his parents or something. Looks like you'll have to confront him. The way you do best, I'm always rooting for you. 
That would be so much darker if this wasn't a pacifist playthrough. Alright. Let's see what we can do. Why did this happen? I did everything in my power to entertain. The monsters wouldn't have to worry about being stuck down here. At every turn I tried to cheer Sroper up, I just wanted Kaneko off her mind. I tried my best to honor her memory. Are distractions what's best for all of that? Hmm? You. Why do you follow me? Are you still my friend? Hold on. This all happened after you showed up. Ed specifically mentioned you as the pro Oh god, my brother, my brother, how about you learn communication skills? Good lord. That's right, I was just being a good friend. I made you who you are, yet this is why I get- Let's face facts, I couldn't keep you here forever, kid. Word would have gotten out and that Feathers hadn't clocked in eventually. Feathers. Wait a minute. Her old guards like her have a ton of status. They gained that status by doing the King's work. I'm sure, I'm sure everyone would come back if I did the same. I'd be revered not only in the Wild East, but the entire underground. I'd... Clover, you've been an excellent deputy, but as a lawman, what I'm about to do is embedded in my soul. My true duty. Don't, don't make this difficult for me. Just hold still. Oh! Okay, what is this about? I can't move. I know I'm better than this. I, a dignified sheriff who faced our opponent fairly. However, you're no everyday bandit, so get ready. Nope. Showdown. Alright, let's see. Let's... Struggle. You squirm inside your leather cage to no avail. Heh. <laughs> Even tied up your skill. You sure have an eye for talent. Alright. Let's try and bite through it. You chomp and pull at the lasso, but it only gets tighter. Still, part of me wishes things could have stayed the way they were. You can't aim for shit, Starlo! Starlo's last since grip. Starlo's lasso grips you tightly. You narrow your eyes and everything becomes letterboxed. Why do you have to step foot in my town? Just a few hours ago, everyone was getting along. Now, well, we're here. Oh, is that dynamite? Starlo's fingers itch for a sharpshooter. Chomp and pull up the lasso, but only gets tired. Ugh! This is the only way to fix things. The only way I know. Is that a horseshoe? Okay. Okay. Alright. Check you. Starlo, attack 12, defense 9, the almighty sheriff. Oh, he's fine for real now. A tumbleweed rolls by. It says hello. Quit squirming so much. Oh. Uh. Let's see if we can survive this turn off. Oh, we gotta understand. Eat the feisty slider. Much like the team, its flavor is ambitious. Come on, give it up already. No. Fine. Didn't want to use this, but I got it. No choice. Goodbye, partner. Oh fuck. He tried to shoot me. Stay still. Don't want to hit my lasso. Oh really? Try to have it. 
Look what you made me do. That last one was made from free room materials. Aha! No, no way. Outsmarted by a deputy? Tsk. At least it's a fair showdown now. Time for a real duel. Duel. Alright, let's uh let's just get ready for this. I'm gonna miss our time together. I mean that. Star was trying to tape his lasso back, but can't find the end of the tape on his roll. Spin! Spin your six shooter several times to intimidate Starlo. First, I was truly happy. I thought you were the real deal. Focus. Take a deep breath to prepare for the next attack. All my sacrifices, all the naysayers, those didn't matter anymore because what I had was special. Oh, fuck! What the hell is that? Now I've realized the truth. The share of stuff, it's worthless. We all tout justice, but true underground status is only secured through pain. Monster Kind's hero is a title soaked in blood. Okay, focusing just makes things a lot worse. Jesus. The end. Nothing but bandits. Okay. Fellow's left hand is shaking. One left in my chamber. I'll make this count. Ugh. Let's see what he does with it. Starlo! Stop this right now! Oh great, but I have wasted a healing item. What have you become? Because this sure as hell isn't the stall I grew up with. Roba, now's not a good time for this. Don't kick me while I'm down, please. I am sorry, Star. I know this is weighing heavily on you, but listen. None of us hate you, the real you. We adore you. What we hate is this false, reckless persona you've created. I have my own baggage, we all do. I don't even know if I have room to say this, but bring him back. Bring back the innocent farm I once knew. I just wanted to be appreciated, revered by all. I was trying to provide a slice of the surface where we have none. There's nothing wrong with that. I'm not even telling you to quit running the town. Just don't let this identity consume you. It isn't healthy. Very well. Lofer, I'm terribly sorry for attacking you. I do value your friendship and the time we spent together. I have every right to make fun, but... This is who I really am. Okay then. Not a real sheriff, just some nobody farmer. Don't say that, Star. You may not be a real sheriff, but... You're the best sheriff I've ever known. Yeah. I suppose I am kind of cool, darn right, but this whole show wasn't only for some personal power trip. I also did it to cheer you up. You might have wanted the old me, but I also wanted the old you because of Kanako. I um, appreciate that star. I believe I have business to take off relating to her. What do you mean? must tell you something. I suppose Clover should know as well. Much fun as it is to have duels and catch bandits. 
There's a pressing matter looming over me. Let's go to the old steamworks gate. Speak there. Saroba. Come on. I guess you're really part of the team now, Clover. You're at her. Clover! Wait. Who'd let you out? I have good news and bad news. I'll start with the good. Turns out, the wife of that old friend I told you about is here. Her name is Saroba. You probably met her already now that I think about it. She broke my cell lock with a stick, sick magic staff and let me go. I also made sure she knew I wouldn't tell Asgore about this, so now that's taken care of. The bad news. I'm about to go back on my word, sadly. I know I just said I wouldn't leave your side, but then, you know. This crazy detour happened. I also realized I threw my job to the wind to travel with you, but since the imprisonment took up so much time, I had to go back. If I don't, at least clock in. The Royal Guard will grow suspicious. Plus, Ava is totaled. It was their property. I'll only be gone for a moment to fix my mistakes. Roba encouraged this decision, so don't worry. She told me she would accompany you on the journey to Hotland. But hey, all works out. Again, so, 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 so sorry about this. I'll see you later. Well, guess it worked out in the end. I was about to run back and fear myself, to be honest. Alright. Hey, Flowey. Howdy! You're becoming a pro at this, buddy. At this rate, you'll be able to confront Asgore himself. Alright, well, let's see how that goes. Huh. You attempt to turn the pump on, but the handle won't budge. These are the stars that Starlow would to be a part of. Huh. Welcome to Sunnyside Farm. Ain't much, but we call it home. My name's Solomon. Must be from Starlow's town, eh? I mix feelings about it all. If I'm being honest. Boy rarely talks to us. It's a shame. Probably thinks we hate his life choices, but that just ain't true. It's because of him that our farm stayed in business during the old drought. His little town attracted monsters to this area after most moved away. I believe that deep down, saving the farm was his true motivation. I do. Hm. Sorry, can't talk long. I'm preparing for harvest. You're one of those wild east folk. Huh? No, I didn't say anything. But this is the corn that everyone's been talking so much about in this game. The cellar is locked. Must be where the harvest is stored. Alright. Let's head on in. Hello, who are you? Oh, hello, little one. Are you a friend of my son's? He's always making new friends. I can't keep up. In any case, make yourself at home. This is Starlow's mom. A dirty hat similar to Starlow's lack rests on the rack. It's good to have a backup. Too true. Alright. Picture of Starlow and Saroba as teenagers. Duh. I wish I had a room like this when I was young. What's this? Just some floor corn. You know how it is. I really don't, but okay. A desk displaying western memorabilia and a sewing machine. Piece of fabric under the machine has been left unfinished. A thick farmer's almanac written by Solomon sits on the dresser, and several sticky notes poking out of its pages. Double-decker rocket ship. Need to blast off into pleasant dreams. See you, space cowboy. <laughs> uh huh. Guessing that, uh. that Starlo and, uh, Saroba were here together then. Either that's, or Starlo has a sibling that's. I don't know. Oh! Look who it is! Hello again. I have some news. You now can ship yourself if you so choose. Ship myself? What could that mean? Transportation, all for free. That didn't rhyme. If you want to travel, give me a call. Set to the skies without a care at all. I must go, but don't be nervous. Just ring the bell for our service. Yeah, but what about mail, though? Is there any mail waiting for me? Hello, greetings, hip hip hooray. What can I do for you today? You have a watch? If you don't, that's fine. 
Because you know what time it is? Mail time, mail time. Receive mail. I truly hope you like your mail. As for me, I must set sail. Alright. Let's see. Mail. Spam letter 7. The monster life can be stressful, we all know that. Wouldn't you like to have a taste of surface life? Well, here in the Wild East, we pride ourselves on being the most authentic experience you'll find in the underground. Located east of the Oasis Valley, step on by, partner. Stop on by. Dolph letter. Who's Dolph? Oh, right, it's Vlad. Greetings, Clover. Life has been a treat since we last saw each other. I packed up all my belongings and set out for Snowden. I recently found a nice place to sell down. I think you'll like it. Oh, all of the neighbors moved out with me. Not too sure where each one went, but I know they are doing well. Also taking art lessons from Penela now. They gave me the cold truth and said my art needed lots of improvement. It stung at first, but then I remembered that you should always improve, aim to improve yourself. Now look at me rambling again. Oh, this mail service doesn't charge extra for that. It's nice to talk to you again, even if it is overwritten text. Please visit me in the future. Life is getting a lot better. Dolph. Aww. Maybe later. I am curious about how things are going for now. Oh, there you are. I was about to come looking for you. So, the Steamworks. This is how you get into Hotland. I ask why we're here. Because of this. The mask Conoco made for you? Yes. You see, Clover, Conoco is me and Chujin's only ch- Okay. You haven't seen her around because she- Hey, everything will be okay. No matter how tough you are, you can move past this, I'm positive. No need, because she's alive. I feel her presence as we speak. A lab. Precisely. Clover, you may not know this, but there is a lab in Hotland. The inquiry for the Fallen Down was sent some time ago. I didn't know what else to do. My time with despair, I sent Kanako with them. It's been far too long and I haven't heard anything. I must travel to the lab to find out where my daughter is. <laughs> Proud of you, Soroba. Stepping out and taking charge. You've been in a rut lately. It's tough to watch. <laughs> so, why travel through the Steamworks particularly? The quickest route to the Hotland from here. Nothing but abandoned rooms as far as I know. I have Chujin's old passcodes for any locked doors as well. Our oh, plan. If you need me, I'll be happy to accompany you. I don't know how ugly things at the lab may get. You need to stay here and take care of the town. I believe you owe your posse an apology. You're right. I'll take Clover with me. They've proven to be skilled on several fronts. Excellent choice. I trust Clover to deliver justice out there. Alright, we've discussed enough. Let's get moving. I'll see you later, Starlo. Whatever happens, remember that this is for Chujin's legacy. Alright. Oh, Clover, before you go, I forgot to give you this. You got the deputy badge. Despite a few hiccups, our little adventure was a blast. Happy seeing you around, partner. Nice. Yo! I'm so proud. Alright, see you later, Starlo. Remember, I'm in charge. Stay close by and we'll reach our destination soon. You move way too freaking quickly, girl. Calm the fuck down. Keep up, Clover. We don't have all the time in the world. I am running! <laughs> Give me a break! I see something. Follow me. Oh, come on! Oh, Jesus. Guess I should have expected this. In its prime, this was the main power source of the underground. That, obviously, was many years ago. Until we breathe life back into this thing, we can't progress. There's some kind of console here. Maybe one of Chujin's codes will work. Just give me a second. In the meantime, you can wait over in the corner or something. To concentrate right now. 
Okay. Uh, let's just uh, look around. See what we can see. Huh, what's this? Puzzle. I don't know how I did that, to be honest, but, you know, the inner machinations of my mind are an enigma even to myself. Uh, I think I'm getting somewhere, hold on. Oh sure, sure you are. Alright, let's see. What is puzzle number two? What's this again? Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck is this? Okay. Once again, do not ask me how I did that. <laughs> I do not know. Almost got it, and think this would actually work. Yeah, me neither. All right. Oh, hey, Flowey. Howdy. Another team up? You're wasting your time, buddy. So far, these monsters have only brought you misfortune. I feel like following that lady's orders won't end any differently, especially with that lab business. Just try your best to move things along and not get sidetracked. Hopefully, we can talk soon. Good luck, Clover. Let's get you saved. Alright. So, with this thing here, there's three more that we have to do. Well, one more we have to do. Is that one more past this locked door? I guess so. Just don't want to accidentally leave her behind. What's up with this? You find a stick of beef jerky inside the machine. Take it? Sure. Got beef jerky. Gross. Door is jammed shut. Door is jammed shut. The jam is door shut. The chutes is clogged with strange looking plants. Hmm. You peer inside the chamber. It's far too dark to make anything out. Oh, hello. It looks like I did it. What's that noise? Oh. Yeah, something was in there. I was not happy. No, it's working. Wait, what have you been up to? Oh, I wasn't actually doing anything this whole time, was I? Ugh. All right, you're clearly more capable of problem solving. I suppose you should lead the way from now on. Let's head west from here, and we'll reach the hot land eventually. All right. Did leave her behind. Nice. I know what we're doing in the future. Gotta have to make it through this lab. Great. Hey, thanks for watching this video until the end. If you want to see more of my stuff, click on either the vids on screen or check out my YouTube channel. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and check the description for more places to follow me. I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll be seeing you.